Unraveling, Feeding the Animals, A Dive into Phrases. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating English phrase, feeding the animals. This expression might seem straightforward, but it's packed with meaning and used in various contexts. Whether you're a beginner or looking to polish your English skills, understanding phrases like this can really bring your language learning to life. So, let's dive in and unravel the layers behind feeding the animals. At its most basic, feeding the animals refers to the act of giving food to animals. This could be in a domestic setting, like feeding pets at home, or in a more wild context, such as feeding animals at a zoo or a farm. It's a direct, simple action that involves providing nourishment to animals. Subsection 2.1, Symbolic Meaning. Sometimes, feeding the animals can be used metaphorically to describe actions that might not involve animals at all. For instance, it could symbolize nurturing or taking care of someone's needs, suggesting a kind of support or sustenance that isn't literal food. Subsection 2.2, Negative Connotations. In some contexts, this phrase might carry a negative tone. Saying someone is feeding the animals could imply they are enabling bad behavior or habits in another person. Much like feeding wildlife can lead to dependence on humans for food, which is often harmful to their natural behaviors and survival skills. In English-speaking cultures, warnings like, do not feed the animals, are common in places where human-animal interactions occur. This phrase highlights the importance of maintaining a respectful and safe distance from wildlife, underscoring the balance between human activities and animal welfare. Let's look at how feeding the animals can be used in sentences. Every morning, she enjoys feeding the animals on her farm. The park ranger cautioned the visitors against feeding the animals. By constantly bailing him out of trouble, aren't we just feeding the animals? Understanding phrases like feeding the animals enriches your grasp of the English language unveiling the depth and versatility of everyday expressions. Whether used literally or figuratively, this phrase offers a glimpse into cultural attitudes towards nature, responsibility, and care. We hope this exploration has been enlightening and adds a valuable layer to your language learning journey. Keep feeding your curiosity and see you in our next video.